Let's go to the next food. Number six, the six deadly food. This is another big one. Fried foods. Duh. If you're going to get rid of oils, you're going to have to get rid of fried foods as well. In Spanish, comida frita. Comida frita. Fried foods. How many times have we been told fried food is the devil? That's the devil, man. You've been told that fried food is the antichrist and you're gone. And yet, yet you continue to fry it, knowing very well that it's bad for you. And you people still do it. I don't understand that. Okay? I want you, uh, I want to show you some, uh, this classic, uh, I want to show you this. This is a classic ad. Uh, I did my homework, man, day and night. Uh, take a look at this vintage Crisco oil ad that I found um, on the internet while I was doing this research. This ad was published around 1950. It was uh, published in 1950 in a magazine called Ladies Home Journal. A very popular magazine back in the day. It marketed to women as well. Um, excuse me. It marketed to women. As you can tell by the title. Uh, take a look at this. Um, take a look at this ad. Whoa. Oh, man, this is loose. Sorry, my electrical outlet here is loose. I'm going to have to tighten that up. Take a look at this. Uh, here is a woman. Uh, that's a woman here's hand. And she is feeding her family, husband and child, a nice golden brown fried chicken, baby. Mm -mm. Don't that look delicious? Huh? Some fried chicken here. Now, I want you, uh, I'm going to read this. I'm going to read the headline. Here's what the headline states, okay? Afraid you serve your family fried foods too often? You can relax. Woo. Relax, ladies and gentlemen. Crisco foods are so digestible, you can eat them seven days a week. Let me repeat that. Crisco fried foods, Crisco fried foods are so digestible, you can eat them seven days a week. That is right there, okay? And there goes the Crisco uh, can, sorry. Crisco can is right there. That's a nice little uh, ad that I found. Now, Pay close attention. Moving this. Pay close attention, ladies and gentlemen. Now, does this ad claim frying food is healthy? Does it specifically say that frying with Crisco foods is healthy? No. No, it doesn't. It doesn't state that. Right? Uh, but it can give a pre preconceived notion that it is healthy and safe without using those words, okay? Here are some key words that you need to uh, pay attention to. Relax. In other words, have peace of mind. See that? Relax. Fry your food seven days a week, okay? It is so digestible. Don't you worry. Everything is gonna be all right, okay? How many people back in the day, in the 50s, when this ad came out, associated the word digestible to healthy? Okay, possibly millions. Possibly millions got the impression frying food was healthy. That's very sneaky advertising, if you ask me. Okay, not only sneaky, but very deceptive. Digestible simply just means that it can easily be digested in your stomach in your digestive system. In other words, you will not get an upset stomach. It's so digestible. That's what that means. What about butter and lard? Were they not digestible? Okay, back in the day, I don't have a problem with those products. My ancestors didn't have a problem with those uh, products. Perhaps a hand few back in the days, okay, but not the entire community or half the planet with all of these diseases, okay? So what's wrong with fried foods, you may ask, okay? Why is it considered the devil's food back then, okay? It was okay back then, but now, according to Procter & Gamble, this is the uh, Procter & Gamble uh, product that they put out in 1950s, okay? Why is it considered now the devil's food? Why is it bad? Remember what Crisco said, 
You can fry it seven days a week. Okay? 